Hey guys, welcome back. This is Dominic with Silver Screening Reviews, and this is Assassin's Creed Unity. Last time we left off, we killed Latouche, even though I didn't get to see the super awesome, uh, unique assassination. Though, it had to do something with me being a prisoner, so I'm assuming I could have executed him up at the guillotine? I don't know. Doesn't matter, though. But we're here at this screen, and, and I didn't get a chance to actually, like, I bought the poison gas um, upgrade, but that's all I could do, because as soon as I exited the last memory, it started up the next one, which is one of those, um, server rift things. So, uh, Bishop started talking to me, it said one line, you should be able to see it at the bottom of the screen as soon as I get out of this screen, but, uh, we're all gonna, we are gonna set one line, but, uh, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, take our drink, because it's Assassin's Creed, and... The later we're getting into this game, man, the more buggy shit's becoming, and it's really starting to grab, like, just really starting to grind my gears, you know? It's, it's getting to me. But it doesn't matter. We're gonna drink. So three, two, one, cheers. Ugh. We'll see what's going on. Oops. Wrong button. They're on to us again. It's not best time, is it? I'm on it. Two seconds. We're close, Initiate. Arno and Germain had some kind of confrontation within the next few months, but we don't know where or how it ended. We're counting on you to find out. Got it. The portal's open. If all goes well, this is okay. the last force migration. Damn right. Yeah, and if it doesn't go so well, you could go into hippocampal shock and take your meals through an IV for the rest of your life. Thanks. Let's not dwell on that, shall we? Right? Probably did not... Oh, I can't actually. Okay. Okay. Because it looks like it's up, so I want to stay. <sighs> Whatever. Just climb. Okay. Because windows seem to be like my biggest foe in this game. Nope. Oh. What are we doing? Where's the portal? Any... Yeah, let's go over here. Get on this. And uh, five bucks is gonna flip out. Whoop. Oh, nice. That was. What? That was quick. Um. Okay. This might look familiar to you. We're back in medieval Paris, late 14th century. You're outside the city walls now. I suggest you find your way back. Oh! Okay. Don't know why I can't just climb over it like I climb over everything else, but it doesn't matter. on shit. Am I back in the city? The whole place is shaking and I don't... I don't know what's going on there. Where am I going? I don't... Am I just going up? Okay. He doesn't want to go up. So we're gonna go up here. There's shit happening here, but I don't know what. Uh, what? Please don't be another one. Fuck you. So that's why there's fucking rocks everywhere. Why are there like... 
Oh, everything is slowing the fuck down. Why are they like- Oh! Oh! Yeah. Oh, that actually kind of hurt, but I'm out of here, so it doesn't matter. I took damage, but it's not enough to make me make me worry about it. But I'm out of the quarry. Where am I going? Okay. Oh, shit's gonna collapse! I did not mean to jump there, but that'll have to do. Okay. Can't actually loot anybody. There are actual dead people here. I can't. Slow mode, guys. Oh, Paris is not doing well. Oh, that must be the portal, actually. What the fuck? Gotta be a linear way there, more or less. I see them this time. I cannot. Oh, that's gonna hit. Yeah. We have enough shit. I have enough potions to get me Follow through. My voice. Get to the exit quickly. What do you think I'm doing? And through. Okay. That was, uh, the Bastille. I was trying to, I was like, what the fuck is going on right now? So the prison's always getting, uh, it's always getting fucked over. And that's gonna come right at our face. Okay, let's continue. Okay, Initiate, let's finish this. You're almost home. Champ de Mas, 8th of June, 1794. Things have changed a great deal since you left Paris. A great deal to be set right. And we're no closer to finding Germain. That's not entirely true. I have a name. Who? Robespierre. I have to be the most conspicuous looking fucker. Ever. I'm actually really curious. There's a chest just over there, but I doubt. Hmm. Doubt I can get it over that way. And I don't. Oh, I was here earlier. This place fucking sucked. Um. Okay, guys. Real quick, I'm just going to go deal with some things. One that being one of them. And. Ooh. It's an initiate chest. Okay, guys, I'll, I'll, I'll be back in in just a moment. Hey, guys, welcome back. This is Dominic with Silver Screening Reviews. And uh, the reason I'm doing the intro is because I don't know if I'm attaching this to the last episode or or making a new episode. Between, uh, like, the seven or eight minute part that was the last episode, and this, there's been many, many hours. Um, I guess I can show you real quick. I, I mean... It was basically me just fucking around. Um, I didn't do much with this, but I did two, uh, two co-op missions. And, uh, I think another pair of story. And, um, I've done a lot more of these things, basically. And I actually got some sync points here that was in co-op. So I hit 50%. I don't think I was at 50% last time we left off. So I'm edging my way a little bit closer. I think, uh, for those, I don't know, I don't think I've said it, but my goal is I'm gonna finish this up probably tonight, actually. Um, all the sequences, and then I'm just gonna play on my own, and if it happens weeks or months after the fact, um, that, like, the minute that I, like, am just a chest or two away from 100%, I will just record those last two ones. It may be just a couple minute video just to say, look, 100%, just to show that I did it. Maybe I'll leave a mission till the end, maybe I'll leave, like, the last, like, level 5 Paris mission or something, and we'll make an episode out of that. But uh, that that's the goal. So we're we're getting close because I was I was trying to balance them in between, but they take so long to do that. I think 
I would end up like skipping out on episodes just waiting you know like my upload schedule would be desynced because I wouldn't or wasn't able to complete everything else and it takes a long time it takes a lot of investment in this I have other games to play so we're gonna as we can see we are starting sequence 12 uh, which is the last one so there's probably a mission there's probably two to three missions in this one and the third one is probably gonna be like the final mission you know like game ending type thing um, there's only two rewards here um, and we're not getting any armor, so it should be a fairly quick mission, I would think. I don't know. But, uh, either way, guys, like I said, it's been a while since we've act since I've actually, you know, between the episodes, this has been a bit. So we're gonna go ahead and drink, especially to the level 5 difficulty, man. This is gonna kick our ass, so cheers. Okay, let's go. God, I stick out like a sore thumb. Who's death? What's all this? Thomas Pierre. He's declared today a festival of the supreme being. A pee into the virtue of the nation and the citizens' duty toward it. Why does that sound? Okay. As far as Templar doctrine goes, it's a loose interpretation. We'll never get close to him in the middle of all this. We best retire and wait for a better opportunity. Still thinking like an assassin. This time I have to. Oh, and what would that be? Think like a Templar. I don't uh I don't trust that plan. Are we just gonna walk the fuck in? Maybe one of these days I should not be in this suit, you know? Amazing! Thought we were supposed to be rationalists, no? What's he thinking? Do you promise me? Bravo! Vive la liberté! Well, if Supreme Being ain't called for Robespierre, I'll eat my hand. Ridiculous! I could probably murder these people. Oh, do not. So yeah, so we just walked on in like badass. Oh wait. Thank you. I don't want to run. I'd rather be a bit behind. Oh, it's a fireworks show. Happy day of the supreme being, everybody. I like that our ascot just freaked the fuck out. Robespierre is unassailable. He's got half the guard out in force. We'll never get within 10 yards of him. Just what I said. But he's not as popular as he was. The Purges, the Supreme Being cult? If we can discredit him, he's finished. Massive public spectacle is the perfect venue. Exactly. Paint him as a dangerous lunatic and his power will evaporate like snow in April. But we'll need some convincing evidence. I have an idea where to start. You coming? Meet me after. I have my own arrangements to make. Still don't trust her, guys. And, uh, where I live, if it snows in April, the snow's sticking. Oh, do not run. Oh, sabotage bells. Where's a bell? There's just the one over here, it looks like. We're gonna flip the fuck back around. Oh no, it's actually where I'm heading. I'm going to... Damn it! Okay, we're just gonna wait him out, guys. Oh, we're not. Bullshit that I can't knock them off. I'm gonna have to be smarter about this. Oh my god! Thank you.
Oh my god, everybody's up here. Fuck this. Okay, well. Excuse me, guys. I'm out. I'm out. Oh, god damn it. And they're gonna freak out. Are you, like... Thank you. Jesus Christ. I wanted to kill one sniper, and there wasn't even a fucking sniper up there. That was goddamn nonsense. What? Okay, come at me, dudes. Oh, really? I'm gonna end up losing. I'm tempted to let myself die, because this is... God damn. Focus on one, Dominic. These guys are fucking tough. God damn. Look at this. Look how much damage I have to do to this one dude. Did another guy come up? Okay. Oh, nope. They're gonna they're gonna come up. Awesome. Fuck that. Look at that. Holy shit, this is not the time to be doing this, but how am I supposed to fucking disable that alarm? <laughs> Fuck it, they can run and do their thing. I might actually see if I can get that chest here in a second. Oh, I learned my lesson. One guy over here fucked me up for that. Can I get him? Oh shit, they've kind of dispersed. <laughs> Guys, I'll be back in a minute. This is gonna be super, super repetitive, super nonsensical. It's actually gonna be completely logical and sensical, but I need to uh, take care of this one step at a time. So I'll be back in a minute. Fuck you guys, I'm out of here. Okay. Let's see. Incriminating evidence. Incriminating evidence. Oh, this? Publiciste de la Révolution Française. The day after Marat died. I am not reading all that. Maybe something a bit stronger. Perhaps. That actually seems like a real written letter. Monsieur, as you have Today's been the savior execution. of the Republic, I beg you now to be my brother's savior as well. 
Even now he languishes in prison, arrested by patriots more zealous in their heroism than careful in their methods. No warrant for André's arrest was ever issued, and yet he remains imprisoned in Saint-Lazare under suspicion. I pray you do not recall my brother's writings in the Journal de Paris, coming as they did from an intemperate poet's heart. Rather, I beg you, if my own humble skills have been even the smallest of aid to our glorious revolution, spare my brother. In his writings, I see the burgeoning of France's greatest poet, a light that will shine for all time. Yours in patriotism, Marie-Joseph Chenier. So as that letter was uh, doing its thing, I spilled my soda. So, good times. Not quite what I'm looking for. What else is in here? This is a big-ass book. I'm assuming there's something in here I want. Merlin, Hallien, Bourdon. These are all deputies of the National Convention. Lists of political figures written in the hand of a man fond of sending his rivals to the guillotine. Yes, we should do nicely. Now, do I just have to get out of here or what? Because that'd be really, really nice. Who the fuck's Elise? I learned as I was going through this the first couple times, it's not that I ever, I think I died once actually to be honest, but it's not so much that it took me a couple times, so much as I was just really impatient. And, you know, if I just, oh, I think she's kind of in the crowd actually, so I don't have to go way up top. What is she doing? How would she just expect me to know where she- I can't actually go through her. Well, Speak! List of names. Fifty or so deputies of the National Convention. All written in Robespierre's hand and all opposed to him. I imagine those good gentlemen would be quite interested to know they're on that list. First... Monsieur Robespierre brought his own refreshments. Strike the guards. I have no idea. We're gonna poison some bitches. Right. What guards? Armed in turn with the daggers of fanaticism and the poison of atheism. They can no more tear the world from I don't think I'm gonna be able to get this one, guys. There's no way in hell. I'm gonna have to redo this part. Elise needs to go is what needs to happen. Damn it, I keep double tapping that button. There's no way, we're right here by Elise. Totally dead. Yep, fuck you guys. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I couldn't, like, oh my god. Thank you. 
Uh, I'm pretty sure at least got detected. How am I supposed to defeat all of them? Kill him. They can no more tear the world from. Okay, guys, we're just. I'm gonna let him kill me, and we're gonna restart this part over. Yeah, yeah, I'll be back in a minute, guys. Okay, guys, that took me. Holy shit, the guards are so aggressive here. Like, fuck my life. Like, every time you're in one of the blue zones, like, it's just, they, they want to murder you. Period. Um, in order to do, uh, and I may keep it, I don't, I don't, I may, like, stitch it in and editing, but in order to do the, make sure she doesn't get defended, you don't have to kill, excuse me, you don't have to kill all the guards. You just have to kill, I think, four of them, and they're highlighted in big red dots on your map. Um... One you can do right from the get-go, basically, by hiding in the hay cart. Uh, he walks right over to you and murder him. Um, another one I just berserked, and then another two I double assassinated. Like, it was really quick, easy, once I figured out the pattern. But it took me, like, six or seven times, actually, before I realized what the pattern was. And once I murdered them, it said, speak to Elise. But I couldn't get close enough to her without the entire map freaking the fuck out. And then I realized if you run all the way around, basically, there's this entrance where you don't see any light blue on me up because it's all above or around me. The dark blue is fine. The light blue is murder. So, um, we're good. So, I'm gonna drink because that was fucking nonsense. I've been recording for almost an hour now. And you're probably gonna see maybe 20 minutes of this episode. Like, I'm, I'm pissed right now. That's fucking bullshit. So, cheers. The fuck on with us. How did I get? Causes hallucinations. This will make him look mad. Now we have to make him look dangerous. The list of names. It must fall into the right hands, anonymously. If our involvement gets out, it'll tip Jarmel off. Leave that part to me. I apologize for the crackling in between that, but I really wanted this Twix bar. Okay. One. Please let this be simple. If I go into that blue zone, I will be considered um, in hostile territory. So I'm gonna go try this other guy real quick. And we're gonna run around, guys, because I'm, I'm not even bullshitting. Like, I can't deal with, like, trying to murder 50 of them all at once. I can't. Like, I'm not capable of dealing with it. And I just... It's just a waste of fucking... Oh. Okay, this guy looks... So, it looks like I... Oh. Yep. Cool. That works. Getting the fuck out of there. Nice. I actually thought for a second, oh, please don't freak out. I really thought for like, oh, for like half a second I was gonna have to cut back into and spend another 30 minutes avoiding those fuckers. Um, what's going to be the best way, the best way is going to probably be dealing with that guy first and working my way back. Than 
Come on. Seth. Nope. And we're just gonna go this way. Why can't I fucking smoke bomb? I don't think they'll make their- oh. Maybe it had, like, poison on or something? I don't know. <sighs> I fucking hate this game. God damn it. We'll be back in a second, guys. Okay, guys. Oops. Let's see. Can I plant it here? That should set things in motion. Where am I going? What is it, sir? Fucking finally. It is wisdom, above all, that our guilty enemies want to drive from the Republic. To wisdom alone. Does it belong to consolidate the prosperity of empire? It is for her. Being a list of enemies of the revolution. Half a hundred names here. Robespierre's gone too far this time. That's at the fox in the hen house. Pity the hens. Now what? We wait. It won't take long. Once Robespierre has lost the support of the people, he'll be no more use to Germain. When Germain abandons him... He's vulnerable. Let's go. Thank fucking God. Jesus Christ, that was fucking terrible. Okay, guys, we're calling it quits. I got, I guess there was one challenge, like, the don't get a least detected had to absolutely happen. Didn't realize that. Um, but the alarm bell sabotage was the extra point. So 100% of this, good to go. We're calling it quits. Again, this is Dominic with Silver Screen Reviews. And thank you for watching this nonsensical episode of uh, Assassin's Creed Unity. I fucking hate this game right now. This game is fucking nonsense. And I'm pissed, and I'm mad, and I'm angry. And any other adjectives I can use to describe how frustrated I am right now. All of those. Every one of them. Throw them all in. You guys, if you guys enjoyed the episode, leave a like down below. If you didn't, leave, leave a dislike. Everybody hates this episode. That's okay. Put the hate on the episode because this episode fucking sucked. If you have any comments, criticism, suggestions, critiques, if you guys did the episode better, please leave your links to your videos down below. I'd love to see how you guys did it because I fucking blew it every time I could. Don't even worry about it. Otherwise, guys, have a good night. I'll see you in the next part.